unbelievable. The fans, everybody around the world, the fighters. This is just one of those things. It's time for our tale of the tape. Alexander Usyk, the former unmuted cruiserweight champion and heavyweight champion of the world, fighting out of Ukraine. He is smoking Joe Frazier, Philadelphia's finest in the heavyweight division. There's no one quite like smoking Joe. Look at this. These fights are so up for it. Look at that. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. Fighting out of the red corner, here is the Olympic gold medalist from Ukraine, an undisputed cruiserweight world champion, and a unified heavyweight champion of the world, Alexander Usyk. Fighting out of the blue corner, the Olympic gold medalist from Beaufort, South Carolina, the Hall of Famer from the golden era of heavyweights, a heavyweight champion of the world, smoking Joe Frazier. What a pleasure it is to be here in this environment. What a venue for this showdown. Did you see that blue Did you feel that energy? Did you hear that beat in the music? If anything's going to get you ready for a fight, it's that. These two have certainly talked the talk. Now they've got to walk the walk. There's the bell for round one. Someone tell these two that they can be defensive for a minute if they want to. He just gets out of the way of that right uppercut. This counter puncher is gonna wait for you to move first and then will strike like a snake. Keep an eye on this guy. To beat a counter puncher, you've got to take them out of their pace. Do not wait for them, because if you wait, they'll pepper and pop you all night long. Rush them. When you're fighting a counter puncher, you want to bait them in to throw first. Make them think you're going to throw a punch so that they exchange. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. He threw the hook, didn't land. Skill for skill, tap for tap. She's like a match made in heaven. Nice job landing that left counter punch. Coming back to life now, starting to land some punches. You're not going to see a lot of finesse and skills from this guy. He wants to bury his forehead in your chest and pound away. You are fighting the Swarmer. Be smart, be sharp, concentrate, but you've got to be confident. Do not dance his dance, because that Swarmer, once you do that, you're giving the man a chance I shouldn't have one. A very competitive round with 10 seconds left. Beautiful counter punch. Let's talk about Usyk. They've got the momentum. Well, we've just taken a big breath, and here we go again. Coming off that fantastic last round. Let's see if he can keep his momentum going. Oh, that punch. And he misses with that jab. Good left counter that lands. Left punch. The 
positives and negatives in the heavyweight division are the same. You can win the fight with one punch, and you can lose the fight in one punch. I've seen it so many times. One punch changes everything. I've seen guys winning hands down. They decide to showboat and show off them. Bam! It's over. So they've got to stay sharp. One punch changes everything. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. They're so close, so close. How can you separate them? It's going to be a hard night tonight for the judges. Lands with the right counter. They have no respect for each other's punching power. There's a right hand. Just when you think they're going to have a lull in the action, we get it heated back up. Catch. Despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. Let's talk about Usyk. Talk about a one-sided three minutes. We just saw it. Dominance, without a doubt, made it look so, so easy. Here we go in round three. Who's going to land the first big shot? Coming off that fantastic last round. Let's see if he can keep his momentum going. Good counter punching. There's no way this fighter can go punch for punch. Their resistance to these blows just isn't the same. Work the body, frustrate them, take the mind off the chin, take the mind off protecting everything around that. Work the body, use tactics sometimes to sort of block you out, box the fight and beat them on points. Good counter punch. Missed him with that uppercut. Still swinging with nothing left. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. Nice punch. A very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other because no one dare do anything out of turn. Good counter left hand there. This fighter's certainly not going to out-throw their opponent by any means, but they will, when they hit, be a lot harder. This could be really intimidating, Todd. If you know somebody's got the punch power, someone's got the speed, someone can take you out with a simple jab, it can be intimidating. It just depends on how confident you are as a fighter. Oh, what a punch! This round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. Let's talk about Usyk. Well, we know they've got the advantage so far, but how does this match get turned around? As long as they don't get complacent, you think this is too easy. If they keep this same kind of pace... Back at it in round four. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. This is not good strategy. Those punches are doing nothing. They are not going to let this one go to the judges. I think it's safe to say one of these fighters certainly has a significant speed advantage. You can tell who it is. When you have a fighter that's got that great footwork and that great hand speed, it's so hard. It's an uphill battle. Nice counter. Do you believe what we are seeing? Nice exchanges from both men in this round. He missed with that jab. Can you imagine if he knocks?
knocks out this legend. It appears that the... Why weren't they more cautious? That was the moment! And they're down. Will he make it back to his feet? Wow, that seemed to be the punch he was looking for. Let's watch it again. So it's plan B time after being knocked down in that round. You've been put down, you've got to think right, survive, and then give it back the next round. Things are starting to heat up now as we enter the fifth. He got knocked down in the last round. Let's see what he can do here. That knockdown we just saw was a heavy knockdown. I'd be very, very surprised if he'll come out Fresh as a daisy. That's not gonna happen. He's got a hustle. He's got a. He's got a bluff. Him. This fighter's not shown us much defense at all. Punch counter punch. This fighter has determined that they can walk through any punches that their opponent throws, and that's a very confident spot to be in. This is when you get in the ring feeling like you're King Kong, because you know you've got a chin that is not going to get dented. Oh, and they just got their bell rung. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill, tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you. And so I gotta respect both of them more than happy. Smoking Joe may go. And it appears the onslaught is over, at least for now. These two were made for each other. They score again with the left hand. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. And a counter left. Let's talk about Usyk. Well, it's no secret who has the advantage after that last round. This is the beginning of round six. Coming off that fantastic last round. Let's see if he can keep his momentum going. One of the best attributes to have in boxing has nothing to do with boxing. It's how well you can take a punch to the face. What a knock down hard. I'm not sure that they're going to be able to get back on their feet here as the referee continues the count. We need to see that again. Some amazing boxing right there.
at some point, the corner may have to intervene here because this fighter won't stay down. Which one of these athletes is going to say, I can't take it anymore? This surely will get a world title shot. Looks like they've shaken it off. We wanted action, and they are giving us action. How do they use this fighter's aggression against them? I've seen some aggressive fighters. They can terrorize the life out of you before they've even thrown a shot. The strength they have, the speed they have, and that knockout punch, they want to punch through you. They don't want to punch you. They want to punch straight through you. So you've got to be careful. Final 10 seconds here, and I think he knows who's won this round. Great counter right hand there. Let's talk about Usyk. It's not over till it's over, but that knockdown. Here we go, it's round seven. He couldn't finish him off in the last round. Let's see what this has in store for us. What a knockdown. You know in the corner now, they're saying, when you get out there, jump on him. Do not give him chance to breathe. Bully him, throw him, push him down, punch him in the back. Keep letting the shots go, because you know they're on shaky leg. They're a, a Nazi away from getting stopped. On her right. He got out of the way of that right hook. And he just misses with that jab. The corner's got to take a good look at their fighter. Oh, I heard that never by saw it. And it appears the onslaught is over, at least for now. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. He misses with that jab. We've seen in the past from this fighter, they don't get concerned when they lose some of the earlier rounds because they know they've got that power that can strike at any moment. Todd, we know one of these fights can knock you out with a simple jab. They're that powerful. We both know who the bigger power puncher is. There's a significant power difference. This round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. Let's talk about Usyk. That was almost a 10-8 round. Complete dominance. You can't leave it up to the judges. It's up to... There's the bell to start round eight. Well, there's no doubt about who won that last round. Let's see what he has for us here in the next one. That punch lands. This fighter is sort of the death by a thousand paper cuts approach. He'll hit you a thousand times before you can land one. I've never seen a fighter so fast in my life. How do you deal with this? You've got to hope, you've got to hope they run out of steam. He just misses with that big right hand. Nice counter shot. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. Usyk, 
And the referee will begin the count. Ten seconds to get up. I don't see any movement here. It looks like this one's going to be over. When you get hit with a body shot like this, there's nothing you can do. Watch it again in slow motion. So they'll make it up, and this fight continues. Someone tell these two that they can be defensive for a minute if they want to. They just missed with that big right hand. So final 10 seconds of the round, and he is looking really sharp. Let's talk about Usyk. What a huge momentum swing that's going to be considering that round will be 10-8 after the knock. And there's the bell to start round nine. Let's see how he bounces back here after getting dropped in the last round. Todd, listen to me. If I knock somebody down like that, that round, you know this round coming out? He's getting everything, everything full battle because I know his legs are gone. So this, you watch what's going to happen. If he doesn't, I'll be very, very surprised. Left counter school. One of these fighters is starting to run out of gas. What do you do as a fighter when you just don't have the energy? What can they change? Can they slow the pace down? Can they hope to, to, to knock them out early? What can they do? They've got to concentrate and relax. Because you know what you can do in the gym. You can do it in a fight. They've got to relax. job landing with that right hand counter that left scores Some nice exchanges from both men in this round and he just missed with that left jab they call it the chin how strong is your chin do you have is this the beginning of the end for this legend Knocked down hard. I'm not sure that they're going to be able to get back on their feet here as the referee continues the count. And he dropped him. The perfect sniper shot. Let's watch it again one more time. So they'll make it up, and this fight continues. It looks like he's going to survive the round here, but just barely. There's no way Frazier survives this. Oh, and that changes everything. And down they go. I don't care how good your chin is. Punch like that, and you're going down. You saw it here live. A knockout win. Congratulations. What a buildup. 
What a journey towards this fight. What a fight itself. The crowd enjoyed it. The fighters enjoyed it. I certainly enjoyed it. And what a way to end the fight. There's no mistake there about who won. What a shot.